Now, it is natural for hair to grow and become shaggy. But it is your duty to either cut it, trim it, dress it or comb it for you to look neat. So if you don't do anything on your hair, then you'll automatically look shaggy. It is natural to be proud. It is a default setting in human being. And no one goes for training on how to become proud. But it is your responsibility to cut out the pride if you want to be humble. Otherwise, if you don't do anything about it, circumstances will expose it. A poor, humble person does not qualify to be certified at so because we don't know you yet. It is until you acquire some level of wealth and position and if you remain humble at that state, then we now know you really are. Because money and position have a way of unveiling certain chapters of human being. A poor person does not have a choice whether to be humble or not. Humility is compulsory in poverty. And so when you hear us saying that we, we came from humble background, what we are trying to tell you is that we couldn't afford pride. When you see a humble, rich, and successful person, they know that is someone who deliberately chose to cut out the pride. As he said, blessed are the humble, for they shall see God. When you see a poor, proud person, they know very well that that is a time, uh, time bomb. That person can be a calamity when he smells money. I've never seen anyone who is fully committed to serving God that is proud. That is the point that levelizes everyone. When you submit yourself to serving God, it brings you to the same level. Whether you, no matter which level of wealth you acquire, you still maintain your originality because of the God in you. Humility exalts, but pride brings down.